Of course, the jobs are rebounding and small businesses are opening because 100,000 small businesses were destroyed during the pandemic. People were unemployed during the pandemic. Of course, things are going to come back. I mean, this is, we're on the backside of, of mand- mandatory government shutdowns. Of course, we should be healthy. But to sit there and brag about these numbers as if, as if you're responsible for them, I find galling. Maybe I'm wrong, but I find it a bit galling, Nick. I'm with you. I, I think that we need to have more accountability with, uh, you know, the accuracy of these stats and misleading sound bites, as you said. And when it comes to jobs, last week they printed 500,000 new jobs, which was a wonderful number. But you know, it was a two standard deviation event, and I wonder, you know, if that will uh, affect next month's job numbers. But like you said, when the government shuts down small business when you know Walmart can stay open, but the local chain needs to be closed, it causes a lot of problems. And it took over two years to get back the number of jobs. So we're not creating new jobs, we're just getting the jobs back. Exactly, there's still about 7 million people that are no longer in the workforce. We have 7 million people less working today in the American workforce than we did in January of 2020. They always fail to mention that part. 